welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a video for you on a new startup business um, which a friend of mine who I used to work with um, is currently working on and she's, um, you know, she is, is right in the uh, sort of the earliest stages and um, she sent me some items to share with you guys um, because I really, really want to support her. Um, she suffers with a condition, I uh, hopefully I'm pronouncing this correctly, called dysatomnia, dysatomnia um, which affects the central nervous system and means she is unable to work. And she has a massive, massive passion for Disney and she um, has, is part of a uh, group of individuals who have a company of Disney princesses in the island um, and a lot of their profits from the items she makes is going towards building the Disney princess company uh, and uh, helping get that out into sort of chari chari charitable organisations and helping provide that for uh, individuals who um, just need something to brighten their day uh, so please 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 support this wonderful new business um, because at the end of the day the profits are going towards um, a wonderful wonderful side business of Disney princesses which is so exciting and something I would absolutely love to do. Um, so she sent me a box of her lovely lovely goodies here. Uh, the box itself looks absolutely gorgeous. It has got some beautiful multicoloured duct tape all over it. It has got little um, beautiful stamps with unicorns and cloud, happy clouds and stars and it says believe in magic and it's just so cute. Um, one of the things she wants to try and do is to make sure that her packaging and everything is all recyclable. Um, she's still working on finding a way to get a good source of that um, so that her packaging is all good for the environment and happy and friendly and everything. So um, there's lots of areas of her business she's still working on uh, in progressing. Um, so if you want to check her out, her business is Bags and Bows on Etsy and you can also find her on Instagram and on Facebook, but I'll leave all the links in the description below. So let's get into this box and see what goodies she has sent me to share with you guys. Oh, I just keep noticing my stamps, there's like a little rainbow down there. That's so exciting! I love packages. <laughs> awesome. I'm gonna open it up. Da -da -da -da. Awesome. Cool. Okay, so her packaging is all beautiful, like shredded pink beautifulness. Yay! Oh, which is fantastic and obviously all really recyclable. Um, it says in it, um, please reuse or recycle all packaging and trimmings uh, as we have. Uh, we love trees and it's got her thing on there, etsy.com, bags and bows guernsey and it's written in pencil because it says in the corner, erasable for reuse. What a brilliant idea, that's fantastic. So bags and bows, GSY, which is guernsey, on etsy.com is the place to go. And it's really, really pretty and I will reuse it. Thank you very, very much. Basically the island of Guernsey used to be Guernsey French and we used to be called Sarnia. Sarnia is like an alternative name for Guernsey. Um, so Sarnian princess is what she's all about, being a Guernsey princess. So in my beautiful fluffiness, I love this stuff, oh my god. Oh, it's so exciting. Oh, so cute. I've got a lovely little postcard that she's written on here and it's got Ariel and Flounder and that's a really, really beautiful 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 piece of artwork and it has a little list on the postcard of the contents in the package and it says uh, that it's got all these things in I'll just show you <laughs> but that is gorgeous I'm gonna put that on one of my kawaii pin boards so I'm gonna put this somewhere safe oh it's so cute <laughs> oh my god it's also gorgeous ah, wow. okay so first thing I've come across is um, she does bow keyring charms and this one, the fabric on it is amazing. It is basically Disney princesses but they are Pokemon trainer Disney princesses and she turns them into gorgeous little bow charms. It's so cute. It's so adorable. I can put it in my hair. <laughs> I can probably put it on some of my, um, yeah, I'll put it on some of my key bags. It's so cute. I love it so much. 
have a look. And we've got a little, oh, a little stack here of bows. Oh, cute. And it's got wrapped up with a ribbon that says on it, made with love. The little hearts on. So oh, cute. So we have a little bow with some cute Disney critters on. I'm trying to work it. Yeah, they're the, that's the Sum Sums. Sum Sum fabric, yeah. It's so cute, look. And it's got a lovely crocodile clip on the back. I'm going to choose one of my new bows to put in my hair today. So cute. I think it might be the next one. Uh, the next one has got Bambi on it and Thumper. Oh, so cute. Oh, I've just found, <laughs> there's also in the box little Disney confetti. Like, you can't see it because it's so small and it's like on this little bow here, but there's like Disney there, you can see there, Mickey Mouse head confetti in the box too. For anyone who loves confetti. <laughs> um, so yeah, look at this one, it's so cute. I think I'm gonna put this one in my hair because it's just definitely my colors. It's absolutely amazing. Um, so Bags and Bows, Sanyan Princess is also looking at doing a pet accessory range as well. She's just started doing that. They have like little little neckties which are really cute in like different fabrics and things. So that's an area that she wants to, doesn't that, that's made for my head. That is made to go with my outfit today. My outfit today, I am wearing my Disney hoodie that I got in Tokyo Disney and that goes perfectly well. It's got thumper on it. And I've got bunnies, and there is Thumper and his lady friend all over my hoodie. So that couldn't be more perfect. Thank you. Eee. And the last of the bow stack is one of my favorite. Oh yeah, she's not a Disney princess though, is she? But she's a, Dis a main female Disney figure. She's not a princess, is she? No. Um, but she's, she is, you know, obviously one of my favourites. I follow her aesthetic greatly. But there is Alice in Wonderland and it's like she's in the rose garden. But it, the fabric's really lovely because it's got, they're kind of like almost like really realistic roses. So you could wear that like, if you were doing, I'd wear a lot of these for Harajuku, general Harajuku street fashion. Um, it would be really nice to incorporate them into a Lolita coordinate but you'd have to be careful on the colours and sort of wear it whether it suits it without it detracting from the coordinate but this could go very nicely um, with sort of classic Lolita if you had a dress that was quite um, I guess plain and wasn't going to clash um, it would go really really well uh, because of the floralness of it but you've got that kind of like secret extra detail in there that it's like oh it's actually Alice in Wonderland fantastic oh I like these ones so much my favorite <laughs> okay see in here oh cute so we've got a piece of that lovely cardigan I've got confetti everywhere look there's little Disney heads Disney Mickey Mouse heads yay Okay, these are really, really awesome. They're like massive, massive, massive paper clips, but the paper clips have got bows on the top. So you have Mrs. Potts from Beauty and the Beast. And these bows are like, oh, how do I describe it? Almost like canvas, like a canvas material, but like a soft canvas, because they're still like bendable. And then you've also got um, the pig. I'm gonna get it wrong. Is it from Moana, the pig? I have watched Moana once and I think that is the right one. If I'm wrong, please tell me, um, but I think that's right. And then um, we've got Ariel, which I know is the Sanyan princess, one of her absolute favorite uh, Disney princesses. Um, and yeah, it's so gorgeous. Well, it's so cute. It's great, I can like, use them. I'm thinking of different ways to use them actually. Like obviously I will use them to um, keep papers and stuff together but oh no hang on you could um, I'm imagining they're probably more likely that you could use them as bookmarks. That makes more sense. Well you could use them for anything couldn't you where you need a big clip but I would use them for bookmarks as long as you know they're um, quite gentle on the pages. That would be absolutely lovely. Oh, oh I love just those. They're so awesome. Eee. They're so gorgeous, thank you so much. All right, I'm gonna try and get under this big poof of pinkness. Okay, 
Okay, so we've got a couple more items to show you. Now these were my uh, very particular favourites. So someone was like, oh, I really want to see what those are like. Um, she makes these beautiful little pouches and it says on it, I'm really a mermaid, um, which is just absolutely gorgeous. And the fabric is really nice too. It's like, um, oh, I can't describe it. It is soft and it's probably slightly water resistant, I'm feeling. Um, it's got slight te sort of texture to it. It's the very sort of soft, um, and it's got a lovely zip and the quality of it is all so gorgeous like the stitching and everything is perfect and it is lined as well oh there's some things inside eee! oh my god <laughs> where did you get that um in cinema roll oh, oh! um so cinema roll for people who don't who are more into disney rather than say like J Japanese kawaii uh, street fashion. Cinema Roll is a um, a character from uh, Sanrio. Uh, Sanrio also makes like Hello Kitty and different characters like that. And Cinema Roll is a really, really big sort of um, icon in Japan. Um, and that is gorgeous. And that is a, um, I think it's an iron honorable, iron honorable patch Cinema Roll uh, in. Um, I can't remember if it's in Harajuku and Shinjuku. No, it's in Shinjuku in Japan at the moment. It might still be open. There was a Cinema Roll Cafe. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. <laughs> um, yeah, sorry, just a bit excited. Yay! I have Disney Princess stickers. Eee! And also, she um, recently um, was putting these up, but these are really cool. Oh, awesome. So they are Disney patches, Mickey Mouse, and the, the color is all really iridescent, like mermaid scales, which is kind of the look I was going for today. Um, and it's really, really adorable. And it it's really, really clever because, um, you know how you get all these cushions and things at the moment where you can like move all the pieces of it, and it changes colour! That is just so clever. It is so clever how it happens like that. And you can just move all of the scales the other direction. I wouldn't try this on a real mermaid, she might not be too impressed. Um, but there you can see, look! It's so cute! And there's a little Mickey image, or a heart, or a Mickey image, or a heart, in the middle. Um, when the scales go the other way and they are just so amazing and I believe because of the stickiness on the back that they are iron honourable patches. I'm sure she'll leave some comments below um, just to kind of fill in any details that I've missed um, so please look out for some comments below hopefully maybe um, but follow her Instagram and um, look on her Etsy channel for more Etsy channel Etsy page for more information. Oh where am I gonna put my patches? I'll have to think now. But yeah, this is so beautiful. I'm gonna use it all the time. Um, I love, I do like seashells. I have a thing that I, I'm not so fond of um, natural colored seashells, if that makes any sense. But I like non-natural colors, like a pink seashell or a cute kawaii seashell, but I'm not so fond of natural. I know that sounds really crazy. And I do have like a collection of natural seashells. Uh, I don't know, I'm weird, ignore me, um, it's fine. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, so uh, one last item, which is also super exciting and it is the same print and it is I'm Really a Mermaid. And I think this might become my new gym bag. Yes. And anybody who likes the look of it at the gym, I will tell you where to get it. Um, so yeah, it's so gorgeous, it's lovely good quality strong drawstring bag slightly water resistant fabric again so it could be good for like a swimming bag as well and a lovely like soft cord um, through all the loops and everything and it's just absolutely gorgeous oh so beautiful I can't wait to get out and about using these items um, so you know where to go
go and check out her amazing store and please support her because remember it is going to a really good cause um, help all those lovely little princesses see a Disney princess in real life and help support a growing business which I think in this day and age is really important um, to support the little guy so get out there and um, check out her stuff and she's always very open to new ideas and things and everything um, her business basically started because of her condition that she wanted to do something which helped her to work from home. Uh, she made a lot of beautiful crafted items and head bows and, and clips and things and her friends encouraged her and said you need to open a shop just just do it because these th this stuff's great. So make sure um, you give her a bit of support because it's hard for people who can't get out there and work when they're so physically frustrated all the time and have so much creativity. So thank you very much for watching this video. Um, come back for more cute kawaii loveliness soon. Love you and bye.